How's it going, everyone? Jesse Cox here with another fantastic Jesse Cox production. Jesse Cox, and this is giving me a headache, and my throat feels like it's going to explode. You know what? Every so often, someone comes along and says, like, Oh, you sound like a douchebag. If that is actually how I sound, then I totally agree. When did I become such a D-bag? Anyway, I might as well wear the tag proudly. Hey there, guys! It's Jesse, and it's time to find out what we learned this week! Number one, archaeology greys get a price bump in 4.0.6. Turns out that Blizzard can't get enough of making people who busted their ass to get something done quickly feel like they got screwed. Thankfully, for once, I'm not on the F and the A side this week. I'm actually a horribly lazy archaeologist with tons of greys just sitting around, so bring on that sweet, sweet 4.0.6 money. Ah, numero dos. More Resto Shaman buffs is a good thing. First Chain Heal and now Healing Rain? The only thing that could make me happier is if they included my often requested glyph that made Healing Rain yellow. Hee <laughs> hee. Number three. Dark Legacy comics are the best WoW comics ever. I don't care what anyone says, I get more joy out of reading those things than anything else. Why did I make this on the list? Because I wanted to. It's that good. And if you don't like it, well, say it with me. Screw you. Number four. Okay, I usually am actually kidding around about nerfs to pallies, but damn. I was looking through the recent patch notes, and nearly like every class has maybe one or two changes. Pallies just got like beat to death with the nerf stick, and they're considering more? Look, I'm one of the ones who usually hates on paladins, because, you know, it's fun, but... Maybe they're on to something here with the complaining. Though then the question becomes, why do they always get so brokenly overpowered to begin with? And finally, a number five. Tolbarad was... I, I don't even... Uh, oh god. Oh, I think I'm being sick. It was actually... Oh, fun this week. Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie, Ugh. it was like 3 a.m., so mind you, it was me and like the other losers who are either graduated or have given up on higher education altogether, but damn if it wasn't fun to have even sides filled with both tired and sucky people. If we can bottle that experience and just sprinkle it all over Tolbarad every time and make it feel like 3 a.m., you know what? I may actually change everything I said about Tolbarad. Bravo to the Horde and the Alliance for the other night. It was certainly epic! Trash! Epic! Oh, yeah! Okay, folks, I'm gonna use this part of the show for promotional purposes because I don't ever really have time to promote things, right? And uh, these things are epic. Firstly, I want to make a boobtacular episode 3 with Avene, but. To make our silly question and answer show, we need freaking questions, and we asked for them, and no one gave it. We got like four. We need more than that. Here's the deal. Imagine you were asking her something, except I would be doing the answers for her. And hilarity ensues. Second, tomorrow is another game of riffs, and this time, we went all out to make this thing freaking hilarious. We put a ton of work into it, and we really, really want you guys to check it out. Please do so. Come on. Come on. It'll be fun for your Friday. And lastly, this one is solely for you guys. Just to make up for the whoring out of the last two, it's a sneak preview of one of the hundred machinima videos I'm prepping for. Enjoy. So now you got me kneeling down. There's so many ways to serve you. Burn it all to the ground. Madness, I have heard you Now I'm serving the old gods I'm so enthralled It's tentacles for me I hear the voices of an Ow, 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 And an old god Please do a 
away with respawning ads in fights. I mean, at least give us till the wipe, right? In mid-fight, come on. Come on, aren't we beyond that now, Blizz? Hey there, guys. It's Jesse after the fact. While I was putting this video together, I was listening to the clip that I used for the previous segment, and I just realized the immense levels of irony and hilarity in the unedited version. So you know what? I'm just going to play it for you and let you experience it because it's freaking hilarious. Don't think any less of me and enjoy. Jack Awful Three Late says, Jesse, you forgot to say Bieber at the end of your little song when you were flying the bear. Well, I'm not sure if you're aware of this or not. This is an uh, industry secret, but I actually don't script out 99% of anything I do, so my random singing is in fact random. So any cliche moments like Bieber come and go as the wind. In fact, I'm like the Kaiser Soze of YouTube. That and he's gone. So don't fuck me, I'll kill your parents. Mr. Nuclear Torment says, You're fing retarded. I love you. And that, my friends, is how you win an Academy Award. Right, Tom Hanks? Vem17 says, Wow, this really painted your GM in a bad light. The best part about this comment is that my GM watches my videos, and he saw this one and mentioned it while giving me crap for giving him crap. It was awesome. Speaking of giving a crap, who wants to be my valentine, sweetheart? You know, I only really have three requirements. One, you must provide a gift. Two, must be a chick or at least sound like one in the dark. And three, be willing to accept that it'll be just about as strange and awkward as this comment to a viewer's response. And finally, we come to our fair of the week! This week's failure is kind of more of a question. You see, I fail at not knowing jack squat about computers, except what I need to do to keep my piece of junk afloat. On your screen, you'll see my PC specs that uh, I think are relevant. I don't know if you need more information, but whatever. So here's my question. Is it better to buy a new PC, and if so, where do I buy it from? Or do I put it together, and if so, how do I do that, because I don't have a freaking clue? Or can I get anything that will upgrade my piece of junk PC and keep it running uh, a little bit better? Or is it totally a wash and just keep the one I have but go out and buy another one? Uh, I'm leaving. The choice is up to you. Help me out. You guys obviously know a lot more about this than me because I get 100 messages a day that are like, I need to know what kind of uh, computer or RAM or d d hard drives or SSDs. And I'm like, dude, you're getting a Dell. Right? I don't know what to tell people. So anyway, that's it, folks. Thank you for all the support. We're about to reach 50k subs, and remember, keep an eye on the channel because 50k means a contest. Not just any contest, we did some crazy things with prizes this time. So, thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, to be continued.